Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some mini donuts. I have the Little Debbie mini panda donuts. And I have the Hostess donuts, and these are the caramel chocolate, and they are new. These were $2 each at Walmart, so these are different size bags. So it's interesting that for different size bags, they're still $2. Uh, this is a uh, 248-gram bag, and this is a 298-gram bag. So 10.5 ounces and 8.72 ounces, uh, $2 a piece, like I said. So these are the Panda, and they are chocolate donuts with powdered sugar coating. And these are a limited edition from Little Debbie. And we've done a review of lots of powdered donuts, but we've, well, that came right off, didn't it? Look at that. Uh, but we've, just tear it, Tammy. Um, but we have never reviewed uh, uh, chocolate in the powdered donut. So, okay. So they're, they're teeny tiny. But you get, it's this four donuts, 53 grams or 240 calories. And there are four and a half servings in the bag. The dark chocolate color. Bad. I mean, they're not. That was nothing to me. No, yeah, they're just not. I mean, they're not. They don't taste bad. They don't taste they're bad. Not, they don't really taste like much. The they chocolate's a little bit there. It's a darker chocolate, but it's. I'm telling you, it's barely there. Yeah. It's, it, it's almost not noticeable at all. That leaves a coating on the roof of your mouth, dude. Uh, the, the, the powder, I guess that there's a little bit of sweetness there. That is, I'm so, um, I know they look like they would have been really, really good. And they're just, I'm so disappointed. They're just so, so. Um, yeah, I would not get these again. They're, they're disappointing. There's not enough flavor there. And I like the Little Debbie brand. I like McKee. McKee are the, they're the same people that make. Uh, Sunbelt Bakery, which blows my mind because Sunbelt Bakery is like up here uh, and Little Debbie is about right here. These are down here. Yeah, they're, These are not up to Little Debbie standards, no. I'm telling I mean, you. You can eat them. You can they're eat them. they're not bad. No. I mean, if you want to sit there and eat them, you would sit there and eat a half bag. But um, you can buy better, better But there's powder. better ones. Yeah, there's better powdered donuts out there. I just I wouldn't buy them. Most almost all powdered donuts they'll leave that greasy film in the original mouth, and that was one of them too. Okay, now these are the Hostess Donuts caramel chocolate, and they have a um, there's like a crisp sugar coating on the outside of these. No, you know, don't you want. Um, they're, they're softer to cut. I can tell you that much. They don't have any description, but they're telling us what they are. And these are uh, six servings are in the container, three donuts, 50 grams is 210 calories. The texture already is, is much better. Still a little light on flavor though, aren't they? I mean, I get the flavor, but it's not no, I think that to, overwhelming. To me, that caramel flavor is, um, it's very uh, strong. Mm. It is a. Um, and they're even more breezy on the roof. It's a it's a burnt caramel. <clears throat> I agree. It, it is a burnt sugary kind of. Flavor. It is a bar yes a burnt sugar. That's exactly what it tastes like. I like those. I like um, of course, you know this is powdered sugar. If you're buying a powdered sugar donut, that that's the texture of that. But I prefer out of the two, I like the texture of that crisp uh, sugar uh, on the outside. You know, it's that glaze they put over the top and then it hardens. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I like that texture of it. I think it's just delicious. And the donut itself is softer. It, it's not as dry. Yes, it uh, it's sweet. Um, and people have asked me, how long are these, these kinds of donuts good for? So we just bought these at the store. And these donuts are good for another week. So these are good for one week. These donuts are good for another um, five weeks. 
That's the difference. Well, I can so, tell you they have enough grease in them to make it last because that's that the the uh, hostess one's really really coated everything out. I have people, I, and I don't know why. I think there's people in other countries, very specific countries, that are trying to replicate these for in their own countries, hmm. and so they're curious. How long should the, how long do they last on your shelf? Because I don't think where they are, and I don't want to pinpoint the country, but I don't think where they are, they're lasting as long as they do here. So just know that for those people that always ask me, um, these are going to last you five weeks. But I'd say it has a lot to do with that glaze on top that it's holding in. Some of the moisture. And stuff. Yes, everything, and that's why it lasts longer than just the plain powder. Or oh, they could have more preservatives. Uh, they could. They <laughs> absolutely could. Yes, they they very well could. Out of the two, though, I would get those chocolate caramel all day long. And as far as these compared to other Hostess donuts, I would choose these absolutely because we just recently tried the um, the strawberry cheesecake ones. Um, I would rather. I like this burnt caramel flavor over those so how did you would you get either one of these again you just wouldn't get either one yeah. again. i mean give me a just a bright girl filled donut from walmart's donut shop over these if any day those are, <laughs> if those are or if these are the only options if these are the only two donuts i ever had in the whole world i wouldn't eat donuts but if i actually had to buy them i would get the caramel okay yeah. okay there you go if so so I'll have a picture for you at the end. I thought these were pretty good myself. They just leave that greasy coating. I just don't like it. Yeah, and if you're sensitive to the greasy coating, I'm not. I just like... It's still on the roof of my mouth. Yeah, it is. It's still on mine too. So if you're sensitive to that, you know what he's talking about and you wouldn't like it. For me, it's not a deal breaker. So I would still get these because the flavor's that good. So um, like I said, I'll have a picture for you at the end. And thanks for watching.